There are four wild things happening in Northwest Arkansas, and the last one I bet you didn't expect to see coming. So, let's talk about that. Hey everybody, if you don't know who I am, my name is Philip Shepard. I'm a local real estate agent located right here in Northwest Arkansas. If you weren't aware, I actually was a real estate broker located in the dumpster fire, the horrible, the hellscape also known as Illinois, also known as Chicago. The worst. Anyways, I was a real estate broker out in Chicago and I started to look for the best place to live in America. So I started looking at all across America, Huntsville, Alabama, Carolinas, Colorado, Boise, Phoenix, you name it, I've probably been there or researched to try to find the best place to live in America. And by far the best place to live in America, that's a mouthful, is Northwest Arkansas. So if you're gonna talk about why I chose Northwest Arkansas versus anywhere else in America, Let's meet for coffee. Let's talk on the phone. Let's text message. Whatever the case is, let's talk about why I chose North Arkansas versus anywhere else in America. Now, if you haven't been down to North Arkansas quite yet, I made something called the NWA Starter Pack. Sounds exactly what it is. It's literally a starter pack full of all the cool things North Arkansas. What's going on downtown Benville? What's going on in Faithful? What are the schools like? What are the hospitals like? All the things you want to know about North Arkansas, boop, 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 boop. package, ship right to your home, literally right to your home. Enter your name below, enter your address below, literally it's a package I ship right to your home. So enter your information below, I'll make sure to get that, get that package shipped to you right away. Also, side note, it does come with your first free mountain bike, so that's pretty cool. And in and I know what you're thinking, I know what you're thinking. It is my favorite for alert F word. Free! So enter your information below, I'll make sure to get the package shipped to you right away. <laughs> Right. And the first thing we need to talk about is kind of wild happening in Northwest Arkansas. And this is just breaking news is that NWAC, which is our community college here in Northwest Arkansas, about mm, three years ago, four years ago, four years ago in 2021, added a bicycle technician program to uh, to the community college. It was kind of first in a kind because Northwest Arkansas is known for mountain biking capital of the world, has 450 miles of trail systems on and on, like the Olympic team for mountain biking lives and trains here in Northwest Arkansas. So we have host world championships. I could get the idea. But so there makes sense for the community college to have its own bicycle technician program. They are next, they are now actually making the next level and actually making a trail technician program for an actual community college. Now this is not shocking because there have been, it's funny because you, if you go over to Google Maps and you type out uh, trail builders in like just Google Maps, there's like one or two in Colorado and one over in New England. There's like seven in Northwest Arkansas. It is crazy to see a, a, a whole business model meaning that you can build a business just based on trail building systems in Northwest Arkansas. Before, 10 years ago, there were no businesses to build trails. It was some people that wanted to do some things and then they built some trails. It's probably actually more than 15 years ago, honestly. Built some trails, then they built more trails and they made a business and they got grants and they built out from there. So now there's over, like, I can think of like at least six trail building companies in Northwest Arkansas that not only built here, but get recruited and actually paid to travel across America to then build trails like they do in Northwest Arkansas. So you kind of need a education now to supplement how to build trails in, in a, the world. And now the actual community college is doing such that. So not shocking, crazy to see a whole ecosystem being built out of Northwest Arkansas, just because we have probably the best trail system in America and probably one of the best trail systems in the world exists right here. You want to then supplement it with a college education as well. And the second crazy thing that's happening in Northwest Arkansas, and this kind of goes back to another big business, is that one of the actual underdog, unsuspecting, kind of out of the box businesses that have done wild here in Northwest Arkansas is Seven Brew. If you live here or if you've been here for a period of time, you've had Seven Brew coffee. Now, the thing about it is that, is Seven Brew good? Yeah, it for sure is good. They call it the Chick-fil-A of coffee, and that is to be true. I did not know about Seven Brew when I first moved here. Randomly kind of showed up when I was like, you know what, I'm gonna try this Seven Brew. They're kind of like a couple locations in Northwest Arkansas. And then I went there, I was like, those people are really nice. Like when I went there, like they're chatty, they're talkative, they're, what are the cases? You, get, you know, if you've been to Chick-fil-A, you know how that works. So regardless, they have been actually, they actually sold the company to a, like a bigger investment firm that they actually owned. So they kind of, this is kind of business stuff. But then they actually got invested into by a New York actual investment firm to grow Seven Brew across America. So don't be shocked if you're in California, if you're in Texas, or if you're in Chicago right now, that you will be seeing a Seven Brew coffee from Fayetteville, Arkansas in your back step really soon. 
very small footprint, no sit down whatsoever, barely any walk up, always drive through. Some of the most delicious coffees you've ever had, fast through all together. So they they can expand very quickly because they actually, it's funny because I was just actually driving uh, down past Garfield, which is a town uh, in like Northern Northwest Arkansas. They actually build all of the seven brews here and ship them to the places. So I was driving past uh, past there the other day. There's like 40 built out there right now. So they're in growth mode and exciting to see a small business started here not too long ago, long ago do so well across America. And before we jump on to the next point, I have something brand new called Instant Home Updates. So maybe you're looking to move to the area, area and, and using things like realtor.com, zillow.com, or Redfin. Way too slow. Notifications, way too slow. That's why I made something called Instant Home Updates. Sounds exactly what it, what it is, literally Instant Home Updates. So enter your information below, name, square footage, bedroom, bathrooms, where do you want to move to another Arkansas? That's kind of important. Let me know with all the information below. Make sure you don't miss a single notification when it comes for homes for sale or for rent, all the North of Arkansas. Also, side note, every single Friday, I send an email out to just kind of talk about all the cool things North of Arkansas. What's going on downtown Benville? What's going on in Fayetteville? What, are the, what is going on in downtown Rogers? What's going on in the amphitheater? What's going on over at Bella Vista? What's going on over at... There are so many things. One of the one of the Razorbacks playing. So many things all the time. All the time. Enter your email below. I'll get that email out to you every single Friday. But sadly, side note, you will get a little fear of missing out, a little FOMO, so to speak. But I promise you, you will be the most informed person eventually when you make your way down to Northwest Arkansas. And the third really crazy thing happening in Northwest Arkansas is actually a new coffee shop opening in downtown Springdale. Now, that's not the shocking part because you're like, you know, coffee shops open here quite often and they're always very delicious. But actually, Cafe Con Chisme is actually opening in downtown Springdale. Now, I know my Spanish decently well enough, and I think that means gossip, but I checked it, so it means basically coffee shop or coffee with gossip, so I thought that was kind of cute and funny, so yay. But regardless, the thing that actually made me most excited was that it has a Latin heritage of coffee, which I was like, Cuban coffee has been actually kind of blowing up in like across America for, for the last couple like months or so, so not shocking. So it's kind of has a Latin kind of style of coffee, so super excited about that. The most interesting thing is that they have a actual way to print photos on your latte. Excuse me, what? What? Anyways, yes, I will be, what What will I be printing on there? I do not know yet. I can only imagine ideas. But regardless, I will be printing a photo on a latte here very soon. And will I, will I be showing it to you guys? 100%. And it's also downtown Springdale. That's a very up and coming area. So I'm excited for that. And the last thing that's crazy happening in Northwest Arkansas is actually University of Arkansas is building a basic prototyping studio or we'll call it facility up in Bentonville. Now they do have this down in uh, um, Fayetteville, but they're actually amping it up in Bentonville even more. So if you want to prototype, 3D prototype, or build any sort of business when it comes to manufacturing, if you want to prototype your thing rather than get it made offshore and brought it in, or like, you know, it's faster if you get it made here in the prototyping facility, they will do it right here in North East Arkansas and Bentonville specifically. So little unknown fact or, fa or known fact is that North East Arkansas is quickly becoming a medical hub for devices. De medical devices are being funded through the Walton uh, Foundation. Medical things are being funded through the Alice Walton, uh, Alice Walton School of Medicine. There's more businesses that are moving here because of medical stuff. So having this in-house ready in Bentonville is going to be a big deal for medicine and medical devices being developed, patented, and, and actually businesses being built here. So regardless what this might be important for you is that the medical scene in Northwest Arkansas is good and it's way better than Arkansas and state in general. But one thing is to be known is that the medical scene is just going to ramp up more and more and more in North East Arkansas. And also innovating and being and modeling and printing in Benville is going to be easier and easier and easier. All right, that's all I have for you guys today. Again, if you are thinking about coming down to North East Arkansas, download my 3D itineraries link below. Maybe you're a venture, maybe you're a sports person, maybe you're a foodie, maybe you're a sightseer, maybe you have kids, whatever it is. There's a 3D itinerary link down below for you. So go ahead and download it and you can use it down here. Also, when you do come down here, I can give you a $10 tour so I can show you around the whole area. Plus we can check out some home for sale or for rent and see how far your dollar would go or North East Arkansas compared to where we're coming from. All right guys, let's see the next one.